In other news tonight, a giant snow creation in New Brighton is bigger and better than ever this year. A trio of brothers show off their creativity, putting it together, but it's more than just a great photo op. Ken Erdahl went to check it out today. The work on this snow sculpture is incredible. It started a month ago and they have more than 600 hours in. In fact, you have to step away a little bit to really appreciate it. It's more than 22 feet high and 30 some feet long. That's a big snail. It's awesome. very, very big. Bigger. Yeah. This big. Take it from the experts. It's pretty good. It's really, really good. This traffic snarling snail. Its name is Slinky. Is big in every way. We definitely went a lot bigger than normal. And that's saying something, considering the Bartz brothers already have a big tradition. Their snow sculptures have grown each of the last eight years. Well, who's ready to see it? <laughs> and the crowds have grown bigger too. I was just kind of go out and make a snowman and, and then it turned into this. <laughs> Which is why dad now has a big job, directing traffic. Just a little bit. <laughs> we have thousands of people a day coming by and taking a look at it. We love it. Even if that means the demands are growing bigger too. And we're like, okay, in order to do this, we got to have somebody dump truck it in. And once all that snow arrived, warming it up for sculpting required a big change to the garage door. He's coming out with wet, really nice wet snow now. Shut it. We don't lose any heat at all. And it's not the only big modification. We had all bushes along here. And our parents were nice enough to let us rip them all out. Just add it to their big list of sacrifices. Whole yard every year, all new sod. From all the foot traffic just kills it. But they'll all gladly do it again because they have big hearts. You see all that traffic also brings in big bucks for charity. We've raised fifty eight or fifty nine thousand dollars for clean water. And this year our goal is to raise thirty thousand dollars. And that's worthy of some big Praise. It's so good. Yeah. It's savage. <laughs> if you'd like to get your picture taken, you still obviously have plenty of time. Slinky the snail isn't moving anywhere, weather permitting. The family just asks that you keep those hours of photos between 8 a.m. and 10.30 p.m. They've got to get some sleep at some point. Reporting in New Brighton, Kent Hurdall, Care 11 News.